50 tractors here now. Uh, we're going out to West Point for a drive on the road and we're going to return. We're going to have dinner in West Point and we're going to come back and uh, we'll have a big uh, supper here with uh, corn in the cob and hot dogs and sandwiches and all the sweets and stuff. And there's no charge for anything here today. The meal is free. Everything is free. We're going to have a lottery after. I think it's just some uh, sentimental value. I grew up with certain tractors and other people grew up with certain tractors and and the history and uh, just the social uh, the camaraderie between all the members. We have 110 members in our club and uh, we own the clubhouse. Uh, uh, we bought it for a dollar. It was in pretty bad shape back years ago but anyway it's fixed up nice and comfortable and we have meetings once a month. Uh, there's internationals, there's cock shots, Oliver's, uh, uh, Case, uh, the Ford, John Deere, uh, a little bit of everything. On the West Point, uh, good spot right there. Through, through the Bray, <laughs> and we're uh, coming okay, back through uh, uh, Polaire. So we're going to have dinner in West Point at the lighthouse there or somewhere. And uh, uh, it'll be a good day. We'll be back here by 3 o'clock, or hope to anyway. And we have trailers to handle people that want to come for a drive that don't have a tractor or their husband has a tractor. We only allow one person on the tractor. That's the legal uh, thing. In, uh, the club. It's a club's project, so it's club rules. I think it's a great social event and just the uh, camaraderie and all that stuff is just wonderful to see everybody take a part in something.